but it was already clicked and I had already shared. It should be good. Let's try it again. Now it should be good. All right, just say to be just say to be there. All right, there we go. One point and it started at one forty four on the clock. And shout out, shout out, We are the brothers of the, the Great Millstone, uh, the branch of Chicago, and our honored guests, former member of Chicago. We got the mighty Mataki in the house. Right. And first and foremost, we want to give all praises, all honor, and glory to Yahweh, Yahweh, Double honors to our apostles and our elders. Salutations to all our fellow laborers out there pushing hard, doing this work. And uh, to the to the scattered elect that are scattered around the four corners of the earth, uh, that are, that are among the heathen nations, the Israelite foreigners, and to those few aquas that are listening and learning, um, which we say every week, but which are, right because and everyone seems to forget that part. We know mm -hmm. that there are uh, sisters out there who are uh, that are heed to the call, that are being obedient to their husbands, and that are uh, you know coming back to our nationality. That are uh, that are quiet on the comment board, or or, or or in order on the comment board with their statements. So when we're talking about the nigger woman, we're not talking about those women that I just mentioned. We're talking about the actual nigger woman. Now I did a video earlier today on a woman who was a complete nigger woman, and it wasn't even about her. It was about the two thirds. It was about niggers too, but. There was a bunch of people that came on the comment board and started trying to defend this bitch. Nobody came to the defense of the little nigga dude who was talking shit. Everybody was coming to her defense. All right. And um Um But yeah, here it, this 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 and this being one of them, this Sheldon uh, uh Richardson. And it said, the Lord done this. He placed the woman over the man. Please stop blaming us women. All right? And um, basically, I know, man. <laughs> Wait, but the woman said what? She said, she said please stop blaming us women. What, what said before that? It said, the Lord done this. He placed the woman over the man. Basically, he's saying that the, the woman is like she is because of the Lord. And, and that's, that's what she's that, saying. See, now, the, when the Lord said a new thing was good, a, a woman will count past a man, that's in wickedness. That's yeah, nothing to do in righteousness. God. And that's because of the hard, hardness of their hearts of, and following Esau in. They follow Esau, their master. That's why the Yahweh Shai told the wicked, you know, you, um, especially the wicked Pharisees, and, um, and you know, you have know, your father, the devil, you know, he was a liar from the beginning, a murderer, and so forth. Well, those who follow Esau in his vibration, they are following under that vibration of Esau in. That's called wickedness. If you go into all the scriptures that talk about the righteousness of a man and the righteousness of a woman, the Lord gives you the parameters and the construct of what you what is righteous. You, the woman being over a man is not righteous, all right. And it don't even fucking make sense because niggas resist that shit. That's why the divorce rate is over what 50 60 percent, all right. And men still gonna dip off and do what they do. You can't and, stop and a man from being a man. 80 percent of, of, of divorces are, are are uh filed by the woman, yeah. Right. I, got a, I got a precept. This is uh, Jeremiah chapter six. Uh, cause, I, cause I might get to Isaiah uh, three and twelve. I think it's verse twelve. And they just put put age restriction on my on on this video too. So they well, it was already kids. not for kids, right? So why you got if it's not for kids, why you gotta add some shit? Fuck YouTube, man. Fuck you, pencil pushing, button pushing motherfuckers. You gonna get visited too. All the regular motherfuckers. Right? It's already the video, the video, St. Vinci already set it up. It's not for fucking kids. So why you gotta put an age restriction? The very video we're talking about. Because they want to defend the niggatry of nigga bitches. That's it. All right. We're not talking about Israelite women. Women, we're talking about nigga. Bitches. And those are those ones that you showed in the picture on the video you did with the first bitch get mad at the stove and she tear up the whole That's the video stove. that that, that, yeah, this, was, is a, that yeah. this is all up on. See, that, that's so not even that. YouTube jumping in the shit. See, yeah. because they're gonna promote that madness. Hit that said three. We have that. agreed age restriction. It's already not for kids. How you gonna age, uh, age restriction? Shit is already age restricted. Yeah. Silly mother. And you know what? And 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 that's the killer thing. 
when you do things like that, all you got to do is draw more people to it. <laughs> we're, we're, we're in fucking America, man. You put an R-rated movie, that's all the, the 14, 15, 16-year-olds want to see. That's it. That's what they're going to sneak in. They're going to see that movie, yeah. man. Yeah. Right. In Isaiah 3 and 12, it says, uh, as for my people, children are the oppressors, and women rule over them. Oh, my people, they which lead thee, cause thee to err, and to destroy the way of thy path. Yeah. Yeah. So like Elder Reyes, he quoted to Jeremiah, the Lord prayed a new thing. All right, the Lord did indeed punish the men of Israel by allowing you women to get over us, all right? But that that's destroying our path. That's not the way it's supposed to be. That's a punishment. And ultimately, Esau Edom is giving you this liberty because he's the younger than us. That goes to Job 30. He's the younger than us, the children that ruling with these bitches that elevated you women, man, all right? That's no excuse to continue that way because Jeremiah 6, Tells us this, man, Jeremiah 6, 16. Thus say of Yahweh, stand ye in the ways and see and ask for the old paths. Where is the good way and walk therein? And ye shall find rest for your souls. But they said we would not walk therein. All right, so that's the, that response that woman gave to the old and book. That's what that was. Shame on walking to the old path. Because they used to this fucking liberty that Esau's giving them. Like I said, this is Rock 25. You're not a wicked bitch liberty to get a bride. That's right. Esau I, I got it on that. All that. Man, that shit I is got it on that. And Esau's so full of shit. They put an age. In the video is called Judgment is Coming for the Two Thirds. And and, and, and and I guess the, the argument on the comic board must have upset them. I don't know. You know? But I've done videos personally that I think are way more graphic yeah. in nature right, right. as far as speaking right. than this one. So, uh, but it's because it's pointing out. The, the ratchetness mm -hmm. of the nigga woman, which Esau promotes. That's right. And protects. Yeah. Right? And protects. And that's destroyed our path. That's why everybody yeah. out here fucked up. Because yep. women and Esau is ruling over our damn people. That's right. I saw, uh, I forget the, the old school lady name. She always be defending the men, though. She be wearing a little African Queen Latifah hat. Stop the ride. Yeah. 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 She, she yeah. said, she yeah. said, y'all women complaining about these men, but y'all mothers are the ones that produce them, man. You women are the ones that produce these. These skinny Monster. jeans, That's long right. boot wearing niggas, right. right. look hey. basically fat ass Balenciagas with tight ass pants on, man. That's Y'all right. produce yeah. these blind head dreaded niggas. That's walking around with a gun and they shooting, it, shooting their own people and shit. That's right. And then you tell them that that oh, I don't need no man. So you teach this young man that women don't need a man, and you teach these men to do act. They, they, these little boys grow up in these single parenting fucking women homes, learn all these women, women um women mannerisms and all this other bullshit and then you wonder why since you did all your recklessness in front of this young man when he goes out you know what he's gonna do the same thing you taught him and you know what's worse the worst part of all that they raised these fucking women yeah ezekiel 16 that's yep. the mother so source of the door yes it yeah says yep. the churlishness of uh the no the and i'm wording right. back the churlishness of a man uh, it's, it's better than a courteous woman, right? Not. So you bitches are way worse than the, the worst right. thing out here. And what did they Fucking do? Mom, walk, walk bandies, man. Yeah. yeah. And what do they teach their daughters? They teach their monsters. They teach their daughters that they better man. shop around. Hey, can I bring yeah. this up? Yeah. Absolutely, brother. This is uh, Isaiah 30, verse 12. It says, Wherefore, thus saith the Holy One of Israel, because you despise this word, mm -hmm. all right, and the true order of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah that promotes righteousness, that promotes life, that promotes power, right? You despise this word and trust in oppression and perverseness yeah. and stay there on. So instead of coming back to the ancient paths, where is the word of God, where is life, where is peace, where is well, order, the good way, the good way go back right? three, nine, and ten too, brother. Yes, sir. This is a... Uh, because I, I actually brought that out in the lesson. Okay, perfect. So Isaiah 30, I'm going to jump up to verse 9. It says that this is a rebellious people, a lying children, children that will not hear the law of the Lord, which say to the seers, see not, and to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things, speak unto us smooth things, Prophesy deceits. It says, get you out of the way. Turn aside out of the path. Cause the Holy One of Israel to cease from before us. Wherefore, thus saith the Holy One of Israel, because you despise this word and trust in oppression and perverseness and stay thereon. It says, therefore, this iniquity shall be unto you as a breach ready to fall. 
swelling out in a high wall whose breaking coming suddenly and at an instant. Mm -hmm. And that's how it's going to happen. That's what's about to happen, man. That's because, exactly how it's going to happen. Yep, because you don't want to go back to the true righteous order of Yahweh right. Shem Yahweh Shah. You want to stay on where he jacked us up, put us under curses, mm -hmm. uh, where the where the scriptures talk about the foundations of the earth, the out of course. Yeah. You want to be over a man. And the chick is a straight thing. It's locked mm -hmm. in. That they are trying to defend, man. Yep. Did you, did you see the damn shit she was doing? In the way she spoke after mm -hmm. the fact, man. Yeah. And and to lock you. Uh, yeah. No. No. Yeah. No. Call to walk. I mean, and and this is why we are dealing with this present evil world and all the madness that's going on right now. I got a precept for you. This uh, Sirach, Ecclesiastes 15 and 20. He have commanded no man to do wickedly, right. mm. neither have he given any man license yes. to sin. Boom. So the Lord didn't command a woman to be over the man right that's now, right. as in that was his just rule. Right. No, man, the Lord punished us by doing that. Exactly. And also, he used Esau even to do it because it says the, uh, the God of this world has blinded them. Who's the God of this world? Who's the Prince of Power? He saw Edom, him. man, because when uh, uh, Pilate came out to Yahweh Shai, he said, the Prince of this world, come and found, man. That's it. He saw Edom set you bitches up to be over Exactly. Us, man. And right. here it is. We're talking about going back to the ancient past. The past where we would be kings and our women women would be princesses. princesses you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Everything would and be just look beautiful. Look at the sister, uh, Princess uh, uh, Ma, uh, Maya Hana uh, uh, on the... On the uh, uh, on the screen, that's just this constantly on on on, uh, on my videos. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And matter of fact, fact, it's a couple on the oh, back. Let, this is a, let me read this this comment from the from the sister, the daughter, the daughter of Zion, because she went at the when the world when the woman started talking shit. This was the commented to her. She said, I, "I have to ask you, why is it that anyone speaks on the woman behavior is always a blaming thing? Why can't why can't the woman do uh, do no uh, do no wrong? Haven't they done any wrong?" Are we immune from correction? And so right. she was righteous for saying that, man. Right, right. She said a woman, she's like, so what, 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 you know, why is it that the woman, her wickedness just got to be overlooked? Why, how is it that a woman is, a, we can, we can go in on, on a nigga all day long right. and get no feedback. Right. She wake right. up and do it all But the day. moment we, we, yeah. we, we point out the wickedness of a woman, Everybody got something to say, exactly. especially you women. Yeah, and Murph talk about it all the time, man. Right. They, they, no <laughs> accountability, man. We all are accountable to do our part, to do our role in the order of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, mm -hmm. man. And here it is for the, the Israelite women who are in order, who also has to be a fool for Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. Mm -hmm. Because these bitches of the world will call Princess Hannah and the other princess on here and all the women that's in order, according to Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, they will, they will call the, uh, these True women, some fools. You know what I'm saying? For wanting to be in order, the order of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah. So just like we have to be fools, uh, the men that's teaching this word, the, the, those women that uh, has hope for salvation, yeah. they're fools too for also being in order, the order of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah. And all these women that are uh, uh, so-called women that um, that's coming against us and uh, the women that's in order. That's when that scripture, it says, uh, in that Isaiah 30, it says, in 13, it says, therefore, this iniquity shall be to you as a breach ready to fall, swelling out in a high wall, whose breaking coming suddenly and at an instant. All right. And then they're going to see that. Oh, shit. We done messed up. You know? Yep. Hey, y'all. Just going to the man. The said they can do bad all by themselves. The Lord going to let them eat that. That's right. I'm showing them. I thought it was on the other channel. Oh, keep reading that second level 16 out. Bobby Shaw. Go ahead. This is a. Yeah, it's going to Second level 16 and 49. Like as a poor, envy is a bright, honest, and virtuous woman. Um, so shall righteousness hate iniquity when she decketh herself and shall Get accuse it. her to her face when he cometh that shall defend him. And him to search about every sin upon the earth. Read it again, bro. Salaka, read that. This is uh, Second Ezra 16 and 49. It says, Like as a poor, envy is a bright, honest, and virtuous woman. That goes to what the elder brother Yaku was going to, man. Uh, the women that's supposed to be in order, you know, which 
uh, whatever, you know, but it's somewhere that, that's sure. happening. So whatever that's happening, you're going to be looked at as a fool by everybody. All these other bitches. This is so true. More hate a righteous woman, and, and that's why some women get 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 a uh, uh, you know they 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 let the pressures of the world pull them out of the truth, because they, you know, that's what happened with my ex wife. You know they let they let the, they let the pressures of the world pull them out of the truth. Man, listening to these women in the world yeah. all on Facebook and Instagram and all yeah. that other shit. You know, right? Some other and, lonely and, ass bitch telling you right. some world ass supposed to be doing for you. Some well, world bitch ain't got a nigga doing for her. Kind. She some gotta old, chase everything. Exactly. She on she, don't, she, she on a cock carousel. Right. You know, yeah. and, 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 and but but that's who you listening to. Yeah. Damn carousel rider, who miserable. She on carousel and still miserable. Right. Yeah. Right. She right. only right. telling you that they have miserable right. counsel, right. but she wants miserable loves company. Mm-hmm. That's wrong with the first chapter. And it tells you surrounded by born to certain people for counsel. You can't go. How do you get a counsel from a bitch that don't know shit? You're right. not gonna right. for you. She's gonna give you some no yeah. shit ass counsel. Well, here you are, got your notepad walking up to the carousel right. and she's exchanging, jumping from one to the next one right. to get wise counsel from this bitch. Give yeah, you all the damn tokens. Huh. It says that the righteous is more excellent than the way that the witness is. So, the spirit is saying it's the seed, if they can get you all strapped, man. You know? This is, this is, this is, this is, I got a scripture. This is uh, the Rock 26, uh, 24. It's, it's, a dishonest woman contends shame, but an honest woman will reverence her husband. A shameless woman shall be counted as a dog, but she that is shame faithful, fear the Lord. 26. A woman that honors her husband shall be judged wise of all, but she that dishonors him. In her pride shall be counted ungodly. So all you Tyler Perry bitches are ungodly. All That's you right. I don't need a man. All you I can do bad by myself. You, you, all you independent women. What's that bitch? Taji. 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 Yeah, yeah. Taji P. Henderson. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Taji Taji P. Taji Henderson. Right, yeah. Henderson. Henderson. Yeah. Uh, what was it? Mary. What was the, the character proud she Mary. played? Proud, proud Mary. Mary. Proud Mary. Right. Mary. right. Taji P. Henderson. You proud Mary bitches. That's that's going off, man. That's it. Way off. See now, as a matter of fact, let's go up. Can, can, can we go? Can we? Can we? Can we go up? Hey, when this shit collapse, all right, you gonna understand the importance of a man, and you gonna understand the importance of a true man. Because to be a man is to know the Lord, man. All right, right. anything yeah. outside of that, you're not a man. And that damn hyena right there, man. She just even though that was a bunch of bullshit that she did. That was that's probably about a good two hundred something, three, maybe four or five hundred dollars worth of merchandise that she just destroyed right there. Now, now, if dude would have came behind the counter right. and demanded payment from her ass, right. then everybody would have had a problem with it. Right, one of the cut, shut, uh, shut right. the ticket and shut the uh, the, store the, 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 the store down. Some just, simp somewhere gonna drop the owner. And, and right. believe me, so the dude them. came all on coming, but bro, why you all on our sister like that? You, you man, go to the comic board video. Like man. Sense, man. They, they don't know what she that, what he did to her. They got Whatever he did or said to her didn't warrant this. She just right, could have right. walked out and not ever spent another dime in the damn store. Right. But then she probably done went, she probably done sucked him off a couple of times. Right, That's exactly. It. exactly. <laughs> and she mad because he, he didn't cut her off. Yeah, we don't know right. what the hell's going on because guess what? A lot of our women be fucking the male Arabs yeah. and them and them and the damn dudes who be old owning. Who be owning them damn corner stores and convenience stores, man? Oh, the brother of Rala uh, witnessed it with his own eyes, man. Yeah. Through three errors, errors running the train on a nigga woman, man. Like, he was in one of them damn stores. He was fixing something in the ceiling, and he looked through the damn hole in the wall, and they and the nigga woman was back on the other side of the wall, getting done by three three fucking errors, man. Hey, uh, I got I got I got a precept because this was gonna happen when the Lord because. The Lord has been the Lord so fucking been, milk and, and, and Newports. <laughs> yep. You giving your body away, stupid bitch. Hey, cheese, man. hey, the Lord gonna get rid of these steps, man. He gonna kill. He gonna kill these cookies and Ray Rays, man. And this is what's gonna happen when it when, when it does, man. This second Ezra sixteen and thirty three. The virgins shall mourn having no bridegrooms. The women shall mourn having no husbands. Their daughters shall mourn having no helpers. So all these niggas that's uh, the, the, uh, paying for that uh, OnlyFans. And all that bullshit, man. Yeah, all these simps that's propping your ass up. The Lord's gonna wipe them niggas out. They're gonna go the fucking the first day of the purge. They the half them niggas gonna be gone. Yeah, they're gonna be too busy trying to save these hoes. That's it. That, that's it, it talks about that proverb. They're gonna be entered to all types of strife. 
That's gonna be like grabbing a dog by his fucking ear. Yeah, a lot of these, a lot of these, a lot of dudes gonna die behind these women, man. Right. 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 But they don't, they don't know what a righteous woman is because they've not been taught what a righteous woman. Is. Um, th- this is, is hey, well, you know what? Uh, well, mm-hmm. there's some, <laughs> but they're not on. They're not doing this shit. They're behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah, and they're majority in the spirit world. Right. 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 This is Sirach. This is twenty six and one. Sirach Sirach twenty six says um, it'll give you the dichotomy between a, a woman who follows the Most High versus a woman who doesn't follow the Most High. Sirach 26 and 1, blessed is the man that hath a virtuous wife, for the number of his days shall be doubled. A virtuous woman rejoices her husband, and he shall fulfill the years of his life in peace. So she's not coming against him. She's actually bigging him up and rejoicing in her husband. Okay. Yeah, a woman is supposed to be a husband's number one fan. That's it. That's like what, Sirach 39? That's it. Said it doesn't be meekness. Kindness and her terminology yep. is like none other. Yep. It said this man, that's same man with a woman that hyped him up. This man is like no other man. That's it. He gonna feel like the guy, he gonna feel like a true mm-hmm. God on earth. He gonna be yep. going through hell. But because of her words, he gonna feel like a fucking God for real, man. That's right. Yeah, no. a, a woman can really literally have some, she could make a break you, man. You could be in your lowest state. And a woman could actually make you feel better about yourself. Yeah, that's right. Or, or she can make your situation way worse. Yeah, that's that's right. the power. The women understand the power and the, you, that, they, that they truly possess through humility, man. Mm-hmm. And second, you no, know, first edge of the fourth chapter talks about how strong a woman is. So instead of using that shit to be a damn snare and trap, like I said, Ecclesiastes, we beating this nigga down. All right, you can use that to, to really be a pillar of rest. That's it. Right. Cause you know, and that's only gonna help you out. Now this nigga do a nigga like hey, a nigga climbed the motherfucking he climbed what five stories to save his grandmother. Yeah. Hey, look, you got a nigga that's willing to do anything. Like you got a John Q ass nigga. Okay. Hey, you will be good. You can't lose. So, one, one of the one of the biggest rap songs that was out there was uh what a uh, uh, method man and Mary J. Blind. Uh, you see what I'm saying? You see that real to a nigga like me, baby. <laughs> right, right, and but and, and he said you never get my my my, my pussy away. But 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 that ain't what these bitches do. But, but if, you, if you go if you go on, this is um what the Lord says is a grief of heart. But what, let me go before that. This is verse five. There be three things that my 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 heart fears, and for the fourth, you know, let's watch what the fourth thing is. I I, I was sore afraid. A slander of a city, the gathering together of an unruly multitude, and a false accusation. All these are worse than death. But the fourth one, a grief of heart and sorrow, is a woman that is jealous over another woman, and a scourge of the tongue which communicates with all. Now that you got these women, listen to Esau, Edom, saying these men are supposed to have multiple women. So you got five, you got seven million. The Bible clearly supports that all they're going to get And he has seven billion people on the planet. If every and, and it's a five to two, five, six, seven to one, according to the scriptures, but let's say five to two ratio, four to three ratio. So no, it's actually on average, even in America, it's it's average of seven to uh women outnumber men, seven, seven to one. one. So now, if you if you Everybody if pair you go seven to one, one billion men with billion. one billion women, five you're going to have five billion females who has no. Man, oh, no, can't they're all taken. Sorry, they would just say this big, this is just so they don't have nothing. 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 They just gotta, they not, they not, there's gonna be lesbian. No, these men are going to deal with these women, and these women are going to deal with these men. You know how many women, women deal with men because they already know they got another man and another woman, and they don't care because that's how it's supposed to be. Because God said it's supposed to be. Then you say, Well, soon as you know what they'll say with that famous y'all. We didn't ask for it. We just was given it by oh, the Lord. This is the Lord's will. The Lord said this up. And we still fair faith because who? Then who's the strongest? Who? Who built this world? Who built the country? Oh well, we produce children. No, we produce children. You're the one who carried it. You don't understand the balance and the order. You will never have that child in your belly if the man didn't put her or the him in your belly. Hey, the the, the Bible talk about how the beginning of uh, uh, wisdom is to fear the Lord, which the hmm. Lord is the power. All right. So you look at that and even um, whether a wider sense or a narrow sense, me and Nadazak talked about this this past Saturday, and that if you fear the power over you, if everyone feared the power over them, everything would be good. You know what I'm saying? Because here it is. The men is made 
more powerful and and, and that, that's why the uh scriptures talk about the women is the weaker vessel because they lean more towards not the power but the flesh you know what i'm saying emotions you know feelings you know and stuff like that whereas the man would lean more towards or should lean more towards the power which is this you know the most high god which is this basically a, who said he is a spirit and must worship him in spirit and in truth right. i got a couple of yeah. this is uh first timothy 5 and 14 i would therefore the younger women marry bear children guide the house give none occasion to the adversary to speak reproachfully and that's what you women are doing man hey they they uh when you watch the old vampire movies man they always say uh the vampire can't come in unless you invite right, him right, right, right. you know what i'm saying you know what i represent esau in this society by the yeah, way yeah yeah, yeah. 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 blood suckers for real and and, and, and basically you oh, compromise matter of fact let me uh back it up with this this is proverbs 14 mm -hmm. and 1. every wise woman buildeth her house mm -hmm. but the foolish plucketh it down with her hands that's you right, destroyed right. your own why do you think there's so many niggas that's getting rich off exposing you nigga women, man? That's it. All right? Tommy Sotomayor. Goddamn uh, Kevin, Kevin Samuel. Samuel Red man. pill this. Red pill that. that. These Red niggas pill. are getting rich off exposing you. Why? Because you have destroyed your community. You women are the reason that the, that, the, that your communities are fucked up. Kevin, that's a question. What's the number one murderer of black children? <laughs> the women. They're the women. Hey, How many abortions yeah. do they bring? Right. Millions, man. And let me read this real quick, right? Because they 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 just hate the order and they hate the word of Yahweh, man. This is uh this is Proverbs 13 13. Whoso despises the word shall be destroyed, mm. but he that feareth the commandment shall be rewarded, man. So you niggas and you niggerettes out there, all right, you spiggers and you spiggerettes out there That's right. who despise this word, hey the Lord gonna deal with you, man. Right. Yeah, and it's a progression, man, because we're seeing a lot of judgment, man, going out, man, and it's just going to increase, man. And I, and, and, and you know, you, you bitches want to go shake your ass, you want to do all this shit, and then when your when your ass get judged, oh, we're not protected. We're not. We're the least. We're the least protected community. Yeah, that's you the least motherfucker. You the you the loud mouth ass woman is out there at two o'clock in the morning, try to put your fingers in a man's face. Right. All right. It's not like their brother. Uh, Stand up for those sisters in the hair shop, the bitches, and then they went back to their hair shop and shit. And after the after the fucking goop, who put one of them in the fucking hair box? There it is, man. Because bitches, and then went right back in there. Yep. Let me read this one real quick. Same same chapter. Let me jump up to verse eighteen. Proverbs thirteen and eighteen. Poverty and shame shall be to him that refuse of instruction, but he that regardeth reproof shall be honored. So you people, you you only gonna get that that shame, man. Punishment is shame. I love it. That's it. Up, this is a uh, proverb chapter uh, 24 verse 20 it says for there shall be no reward to the evil man the candle of the wicked shall be put out my son fear thou the lord yahweh and the king and meddle not with them that are given to change so going back to the the, the way that the woman is over the man that's that's a that's a that's wicked change yeah, it's a wicked change according to how the lord set things up on the right hand side it says for their calamity shall rise suddenly and who knoweth the ruin of them both that's right. It's, they set up for failure. The whole, the whole feminist thing, and now you want to, the, the feminist thing in the 70s, now you want to know why, you know, you should jump off, and, and, and that man is so disconnected from you, they're like, I ain't getting in the middle of that shit. I love that shit. I'll be back. Like, <laughs> I'll be in the back. I can wait till you knock this goofy bitch out. <laughs> yeah, that's why it says, instead of a friend, uh, it says, uh, uh, instead of a friend, be not an enemy, man. You nigga women, you don't realize, see, when you, when you don't have no accountability, then you go around, you make about a hundred minute enemies every day. You make enemies yep. that you don't even yep. know you made. Yep. Man, we don't we don't have that. You know what they said in uh Scott, uh, not Scarface, but uh Goodfellas. He said uh women and children can be careless, yep. but men we cannot afford to be careless, man. Yep. We can't go over yeah, with Godfather. We cannot fucking afford, we cannot afford. See, man, we understand we can't go around making enemies like that. Man. Yeah, I said the same thing. I said this. What you're saying right now, I just said that to someone a couple of days ago. We men understand that, okay, this is by this guy, he's six three, six four, I'm six feet, I'm strong, he's strong. It's like what we say about different MMA fights, even though it's like if, if he even he matched with somebody who's actually well over overmatched to somebody, they be like, Oh, he gonna whoop his ass. Well, you never know. Everyone's got what 
a puncher's chance. Yeah. We know that Derek Derek Williams, he can uh what's his name? Derek Derek Lewis. Derek Lewis, he's so strong. He could be down. We've seen him in fights down. Everybody oh, whooping yeah. his ass, and he just happened to catch you on one. All it takes is up. one shot from him. And and, 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 and left or right hand. That's right. And he's down. Right. So when you notice his ass the all three rounds. All three rounds. No, if he don't matter of fact, that was one of his recent not too long ago, where he said, Oh, he's done for. Now it's almost at the end of the third round, he catches one yep. boom, and, there, and that was it. And he comes down and do this little thing with the stick out his tongue. And I tell you right there, men knowing this, because we've been in this shit where we've been a dominant one and then got, got caught snoozing. Or somebody thought was, was, took us for granted, and we caught them snoozing. That instantly taught us as young men. This we went to our pecking order as fucking 12, 13, 14 right. years old. But right. we understand that men make sure. That, that's why niggas shoot niggas so much, because they know a nigga could come up on them and beat them down with their hands. That's why niggas got guns. Them niggas see another nigga got a gun, and, and it's and always a standoff. And that, and that and that sort of energy it, it comes from 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 being raised by, by women. women. Yeah, yeah, women. Yeah, yeah, women. Women. Yeah. 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 One more verse. It says these things belong to the wise. So, like like you just said, that's something that we understand. We learn. We we know this. So now we more as much cautious. We still might talk shit, you know, saying, but we 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 talk to men differently when then we would talk. To uh, a woman, because we already know, we never know what the nigga gonna do. Right. Now these women, they are they brazen. They don't give no fuck. The little small four foot seven bitch will go to the six foot nigga mm -hmm. and smack him, knowing that she got she nine got, one one. Excuse me. She got nine one one. And she got everybody, even a why, even if somebody see her smack the nigga and he smack her back. Why you hit a girl? Yeah. They don't say why you hit this man. Just don't you know this motherfucker? A fucking gor gorilla. Would you go up into the goddamn lion's cage? Would yeah, you yeah. ever see all oh, the lions? The, the motherfucker went into the lions uh, and the lion killed him. Oh, we gotta put down the lion. No, the bitch jumped over. Right. You go go go, go past the damn. That's retarded. Man. Right. And that's you what know? they do when they come deal with the man. They go past the safety bar because we are men. All right. And they don't respect that. And this shit started back with Bash Dive <laughs> uh, Hey, hey, you got um. Shit, well, when uh was it Julius Caesar that got stabbed up? All this all these motherfuckers stabbed his ass up. He was uh, uh his even his friend, Brut yeah, Brutus. Brutus. He looked he, he said, Hey two Bruti, which mean me, you too, Brutus, meaning everybody didn't like your ass, nigga. And that and that's the same thing happened in the scary movie and shit when that nigga one was all loud. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And everybody's like, shut up, bitch. See, that's what's about to happen to the nigga woman in America, man. Everybody's tired of your ass, man. Turn the sound off. It said it is it says it is not good to have respect of persons in judgment. The Torah three and nine, the blessing of the father establishes the houses of children. The curse of the mother who is not foundation, man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she, 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 she can pull it down, root it out. Like, you know, the household is not respected. They, you know, she, she'll go about the fucking they destroyed town. the household, the institution of marriage. Go, go around yeah. the town, and everybody's looking at her like, damn, man. His wife was a Jezebel. Everybody didn't hit. It was just like that scene in Rosewood, how everybody was laughing. They had no problem going murdering niggas, but, you know, they all knew. That, that that a nigga didn't touch your wife. Right. Everybody one because one of the dudes laughed and told him, hey, well, shit, we all be fucking your wife, man. What you know? <laughs> and he the only simp, dumbass nigga. Right. <laughs> yeah, the damn cracker hood. It was a nigga. His damn wife was banging everybody, man. Yeah. All right. And so they they knew it. All right, but it was an excuse to 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 uh to to, to just fuck up and hurt Jake, man. Yeah. But the problem is is that when you think go back to that movie, there was a nigga woman working for for the man at the store. He was only one had a he was a only guy that had a a, a, a white store in the so called nigga neighborhood, man. And he had the nigga woman working for him. What what was happening? She, she was fucking him. Yeah. But guess what? You know you know if you remember what happened to her, she got laid. She got soft out like a mire. Right? Street. She got she got they they literally uh, fucked her to death. They fucked her and then they killed her. Well, she, she got banged by, by by a whole group of Edomites and then they killed her. Yeah. Well, All right. So you, you make it so you making these alliances with, with your enemy to help destroy your own people, man. It's it's not a good thing. Scripture says uh the uh that lovers shall despise thee, they shall seek thy life, man. You know, hey, you gonna hey, I always say it, man. You gonna have Russians come show me the walk. 
Yeah. <laughs> Show me this. Let me see this walk. Let me see this. I don't like it. <laughs> Push it out the window. <laughs> I don't like it. I, I don't I, like I, this walk. Well. It's hey, wet. Hey, hey, the voice. Oh, you got to get a voice of I feel nothing. I feel nothing with this bitch. It makes the room stink. I feel nothing with this bitch. Throw it out the window. Yeah. So this is, a, you know what? Because they made a joke out of this. But this is actually true to life. This is this is actually how the nigga woman, how she she acts, man. All right. Yeah, I hate that shit. Talking to the movie. And you no, know I mean, but they they loud and they ignorant. All right. Once again, we're not talking about Israelite women. We're talking about the damn nigga. That's how she is in life. That's that Proverbs nine thirteen, man. All right, she is clamorous. She knows nothing. That's man. right. Just loud. Hey, that's Sirach 26 and uh, 8. A drunken woman and a gatherer abroad causes great anger, and she will not cover her own shame. Um, as far as we want to uh, go up, no, verse, uh, yeah, yeah. If, if she had made all this is good, that's oh, not the one I wanted to go. Um, she had verse 7 at, an evil wife is a yoke <laughs> shaken to and fro. He that have hold of her is that though he held a scorpion. These bitches are scorpions. The Lord likened these wicked women to scorpions. All right, who wants to go hold a scorpion? Not me. I want to hold some sweet wife. But they took the they took the knife from him. See, they wouldn't even let that nigga stab that. Like, Give me that knife, bro. Fuck that. See, this was about to happen to right by Edomites on top of that. Yeah. This shit true to life, man. Yeah. All right, and they man, this shit. Actually, I remember seeing this. This shit was funny as hell. Yeah, but and, you know, even the cops it's did. funny, <laughs> right? But it's it's it, but the thing Even is, the, is the that rabbi, the booty everybody, everybody killing this bitch, man. All right, Brother Teresa. <laughs> As a matter of fact, somebody got Michael seven and ten. Yeah, speaking of everybody, doing All right. And she can't understand and figure out why y'all doing this to me. Cause you ain't sick. All right, get no, give give me Michael seven and ten. Michael chapter seven verse ten. Then she that is my enemy shall see it, and shame shall cover her which said unto me, Where is the Lord thy God? My eyes shall behold her. Now shall she be trodden down at the mire of the streets. Right, like shit, yeah. man. That's what that, that word mire literally translates to, man. You know, yeah. like I said, these, these bitches gonna look like gum on the sidewalk, just a little black spot. That's right. I was just watching this video from uh Kevin Samuels, right? The chick fucking said, Look, I'm trying to figure out how to find the man, and uh the bitch was married to a man 10 years, yeah. slept on the dude, slept, uh, slept around on the dude multiple times. The dude that's cheated, right. so called cheated once, which that's not even cheating, okay? Uh, and she left him, took the kids, fucked his cousin, and had a baby with his cousin, and tried to ask relationship advice from Kevin Sanders. You know, the best advice I can give you is kill your fucking self, man. <laughs> and she still wouldn't accept that she went off of that shit. No, it sounds like you don't realize you fucking she's not nothing wrong. Add excuse for this, excuse for that. She wiped them out. Yeah, right. I was yeah, about to get it. Go ahead that's and get right. It, yeah, yeah. Well, and that's the same chapter. It says a drunken woman yeah, yeah. gather abroad causes great anger, and she will not cover her own shame, which is she's going to, even though she's being shameful, being wicked, and being known. You know what? I did that scene and I forgot to open it up. I had to re replay it because, uh, we saw it, but it wasn't on camera. I got it. Yeah, I forgot. I Just got kidding. it, brother. This is Proverbs 30 and 20, and it reads, Such is the way of an adulterous woman. She eateth and wipeth her mouth and saith, I have done no wickedness. And and, that, and that's what you know, and every woman that gets caught doing the uh committing adultery, they all they all have Ooh. an excuse. They all say, Oh, I was wrong, I shouldn't have done it. Won't make but there's always a but. Yeah. But had if you had a not, oh right. this is always a but in there, all right. Ain't, ain't no fucking butt, man. I got one to back up what you just said. Oh, this yeah. is uh, Jeremiah 3 and 3. Therefore, the showers have been withholding, and there has been no latter rain. And thou hast a whore's forehead that refuses to be ashamed. Mm. And that's hey. the thing. They don't refuse to take ownership. It's always a displacement. They always say, yeah. well, yo, did this, you didn't. They don't ever yeah. own up on the shit that they do. Right? The last nigga no woman that I was actually in a relationship with, when she cheated on me, it was my fault. It's always your fault. Man. It was my fault. Yeah. Like, you know, you spilled the water on the floor and there was a dick next to it. 
You know what I'm saying? Uh, and you know what I mean? That's, that's, that's all I'm saying. Right. So I went to go clean up the water, and I don't know how that dick ended up in my mouth. Yeah, uh, shut yeah. your ass up, yeah. man. Hey, listen, man. You women, man. Listen, the day is coming where we're gonna step outside and we're gonna be stepping over your bodies, man. It's gonna be, it's gonna be weave and, and it's gonna be hell weave everywhere. <laughs> it's gonna be motherfucking weave kill eyelashes. Them puffy ass little sandals y'all be wearing for the fucking dollar store, man. Yes. And what's this shit with these big ass plastic showers, stupid ass shower bags? The bonnets. Oh, the bonnets. Oh, oh, don't don't get some hoses. Don't get their hands. Oh, they got men. They got men. What the fuck? Why they, do you? They, they look like you got a trash bag on your head. Look like a Mario That brother shit there. is not cool, man. <laughs> yeah, you do. You yeah. have a damn a mushroom on your head. Yeah. Man. It was Super Mario. Like somebody go hit your head. It's gonna go boing. Yeah. What the what is that shit, man? That's right. Uh, uh, this, I got this, this is Isaiah 32. I'm gonna start at nine. Rise up, ye women that I see. Perfect. Hear my voice, ye careless daughters. Give ear unto my speech. Many days and years shall ye be troubled, ye careless women. For the village shall fail. That's it. The gathering shall not. That venture shall be all their shit that you fucking love today. Go read Isaiah the third chapter and see about the wimples and the crispy pins and the mantles and all that other bullshit in your closets and your goddamn dresses. None of that shit gonna save you in that day. And all, all that shit that you put your faith in, you put your money in, it's gonna show itself to be not. They gonna feel it. Hey, coming on this upcoming month. All right, the uh, the fucking uh, the renters. Moratorium. All right, that shit is over with, man. Yeah, it's a lot of these bitches, and uh, these bitches ain't been paying rent. All right, bitches. Yeah, a lot of bitches getting ready, getting ready. Now you're gonna be forced on the carousel. Yeah, New York, they be criminalized a horror, horror yeah. tree. Yeah. A bitch can go walk the strip now in New York, man. Yeah. All right, <laughs> 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 because the bitches be trying to walk it off. It's over with, man. Your structure and you trust me, Esau. Your, uh, your uh, trust me, so shall be your shame. Yeah. Man. Yeah, let me get this one in. This is, this is verse 11 of that same thing. Tremble ye women that are at ease. Be troubled, ye careless ones. And you about to go through hell, man. You about to get fucking evicted. All right, and this, this is when the pandemic first started. All right, the, the, the renters, the people that rent the prisons out, the trade, uh, you can still stay here for sex. All right, but they cracked down on that. So what's left? Eviction, man. Right. I can't get my, you ain't got the money, you ain't getting my rocks off, you evicted. You bitches about to go through it, man. That's you it. Have to go to the yeah. lane, bitch. That's <laughs> right. You street can get that money. Yeah. So they, they, they don't understand what's so going to happen. So you and all the mugly ass kids, right? <laughs> yeah. You about to get, right, you got to get bit, about to get put out these properties. These damn oh, landlords don't want to deal with you. Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's yeah. right. Them, them landlords will be like, fuck them nigga babies. <laughs> right and, and 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 what's gonna happen in the, in the, in the siege when Esau after the, uh, after he forces you with these waters and all these uh, uh waxes and stuff as yeah. the brother say uh it's gonna you're gonna end up being stuck uh like Chuck with nothing and you know what you're gonna do uh, uh Lamentations four and nine they that be slain with the sword are better than that to be, be slain with hunger for these pine away what they pine away what stricken through the for the want of the fruits of the field. All right, they're gonna want that vintage back. They're gonna get that. The hands of the pitiful women, all you silly ass, wicked ninja women, not the righteous women. All right, because real quick segue, there is an elect lady, second John one and one, the elder unto the elect lady and her children, whom I love in the truth, and not I only, but also they that have known the truth. We're not talking about that woman. All right, they are in order. But these women right here, she the Lord said, um, they these pitiful women have sodden cooked. Their own children, huh? they were their meat in the destruction of the daughter of my yeah, baby. Yeah, that's what's getting ready to happen to a lot of these women with these multiple babies mm -hmm. with uh, with all these different men. I, I, I suppose that the, the man that they hate the most, that child going to be the first one to get put in the fire. Right. All right? Because, yeah. It's, I, it's, he, every time I see him, yeah, he reminds me of your daddy. Yeah. Man. The poor little boy is cursed because he looked like his father. Yeah. Absolutely, brother. Okay. Uh, Show me ye women that are at uh, this is uh, Isaiah 32 and 11. Show me ye women that are at ease. Be troubled, ye careless ones. Strip you and make you bare and gird cycle upon your loins. They shall lament for the teeth, mm -hmm. for the pleasant field, for the fruitful vine. They're going to want the hot, hot, crunchy curls. They, they want, want them hot. No, no, no. Let me just take that back. They want their crab legs. They want that. Yeah, what, set, 
<laughs> they don't want the crab legs. They want the butt. Cause you go, if I, I can pull up a picture, the bitch at the goddamn crab market, big fucking crab thing, it's up to holding up the crabs and all that shit. The new brag, the new brag right now, the new flex with these hoes. They go on social media and say, "Oh, my chick, my my child will take regular lunch to lunch. They want crab legs for lunch boys. at school. Right? So, uh, frankly, they say they want boys for lunch at school. Boy. Damn, that's, that's the new flex for a bitch. I give my son crab legs all the time. Well, when they, when so they, you uh, giving your son diabetes and heart attack? Yeah, and Obama and giving them roaches. Let me read the lamentation yeah, that, the, uh, uh, that they put up on the screen. It's lamentation four and three. They want Even the sea monsters draw out the breasts. Right. Mm -hmm. They give suck to their young ones. The daughter of my people has become cruel." Like the ostriches in the wilderness, wilderness, man, and the ostrich, ostrich is known for letting letting her children, her her, 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 her yeah. children perish, man. And step oh, on she don't step, yeah. them, she step on them and crush them. She bury them yeah. and don't know where she and left them. Right, yeah. and then and the snake go find them and eat them. And uh, and then when you go deeper into this as well, uh, even the sea monsters draw the breast. These bitches right now they draw off the infamil. They go ahead and get you the what's the other one, similac. And you know all that shit. Is and that's only... why they be loose as hell. Yes, because yes. you get ran up in. By all these different men, you got all these different babies, mm -hmm. right? Do you not know that breastfeeding actually is a, is an enzyme mm -hmm. from from breastfeeding that actually tightens your vagina back up? Mm -hmm. So the woman, if you bre if the, if you actually breastfeed your child, it actually tightens your vagina back up naturally. That's it, right? And by denying, but but <laughs> but not wanting to do that, Lucy you know. Goosey. Now you just right, Lucy Goosey. Right, and then then the malnutrition that these children get. Now they wonder why Derrick Rose ankles broke every goddamn way. He was in the projects, drinking goddamn fluorinated water, and it was with a woman, a, a, a single parent of mother being deal, deal, dealing a motherfucking getting nothing, no nutrients, no things to build up your body. Bones are weak. Weak is that, that's what happens Muscle too, man. Explosion. When your when your muscles overpower your bone structure. No, no, that was happening a lot, man. This, and lately, but that's something that was happening. Uh, uh, recently, that wasn't happening and eight, years no, ago. Uh -uh. This is relatively new because now you see a woman who breastfeed her child. That say if the child is five years old, this is how tall the child is. You will see a um, a, the, a, a five year old or even a six year old child on Similac, and they're a good two, three, four inches shorter and and, and less in strength because that you don't get those natural nutrients and so, all the chemicals. That's it. That's, that's it. it. The body, the body doesn't get a chance. The digestive tract doesn't get a chance to set up. You know, as, as you start breastfeeding. So the enzymes, like the uh, Elder Michael was saying, it, it, it's in the milk, and it sets up the digestive tract. Then it starts sets up the, the forming of the brain, mm -hmm. and then it's, it, it sets up all these things. As as as, as the milk gets older and the kid gets older, it, it keeps changing. And you're supposed to breastfeed for two, three years, and some of these people did longer than that. That's it. You know what I'm saying? And that's healthy. Those children are strong. These children are ox. These you know got their nipple fears. They ain't trying to do that. That's <laughs> right. hey, and, and, that and, and that's, and that's got, awesome. They got breast stoppers. Breast stoppers. The scripts I read, it says, uh, I read it that the young women marry and bear children. Yeah. It shows you that we're supposed to get them young, man, which is why Esau is a motherfucking bastard, okay? And you're going through fucking slavery, and we're going to fucking put a fucking flaming spinning boot in your ass because you're making us fucking wait to these bitches to fuck the whole football team when their minds are all fucked up and screwed up. Now we got to deal with this damn trash out here, man. No, I, when we, and then niggas want to get mad at us. Yeah. Niggas want to get mad at us. Cause saying any scholar will tell you that Mary, when she, when she got with Joseph, was about 12, 14 years old, man. All right, but you want to get mad at us, cause rapists, and your damn grandma got married at, at that at that damn age. And that's Her mama, yeah. And my great grandma was twelve, my, and my great grandpa was twenty-one. They, 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 that that was a normal age, man. Yeah. Matter, yeah. matter of fact, you just go back three generations, and and most most people that go back generations. Uh, if your if your grandparents were born in the earlier part of the 19th century, more than likely they got married at, at, at 13, 14, 15 years old, man. Because I, 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 my, my, uh, my father's uh, mother, my, uh, my father's father, his, his, his wife, he, uh, she, my, my grandmother was like 14 when she married uh, my grandfather, man. All right, they all and, they, and they, and they messed around and had 12 kids together, man. Well, it, like you said, but, but the. But when the and father, that was normal but when going the, back 70, 80 years ago. But when the but when the father went to give his daughter away, he gave her to someone that was respectable, that had a staff that was established. They even showed you that in color purple. Yeah. yeah. All right. When she when he gave the girl to Mister, Mister was a grown ass man already established. Same thing. It wasn't, it wasn't no pedophilia. That's just the way things were. That was biblical. Rolling. But see, 
but but what they do is they shine a light on that. Give me that scripture. Woe unto them they call evil, evil good, good and good evil. evil. What they did was they, they shine a light on it to make it look like something wrong with it. And, and, what, the, and what the old lady, I mean the young girl said when she's at the funeral, how'd he die? Uh-oh, top of me. On top of me. Yeah. Right. Exactly. And these people, these people are Christians though. These people are Christians though. These people are supposed to be Christians. They're supposed to believe in Christ, right? But how old was Christ's mother when he got with his father? She was about 12 years old. Any historian would tell you that, but we're rapists, though. Oh, they don't even believe that. They don't even believe that. Yeah, they, they believe that. They believe oh, they, they believe it was a virgin birth. They don't believe that happened. Yeah. yeah. So, oh, so even though he <laughs> cheated them, because they don't come with that argument. Well, uh, she may have been 12, 13, 14 years old, but he never had sex with her, not with the Lord anyway. Maybe <laughs> with the other kids. <laughs> that's, that's, Maybe the angel. Angel. That, that, angel. Angel. <laughs> right. Uh, right. Right. So angel's coming down now. And, 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 and right, you know, swinging. Yeah, right, right, right. The, the, the nigga with dreadlocks on the beach, an angel oh, and shit. Oh, oh, yeah, the oh, angel hey, named, girl. The hey. angel named Dexter. How you doing, yeah, hey. Dexter? Hey. How you doing, girl? Hey, I, uh, <laughs> I did a, I you hey, when I was in the world uh, doing shows, I did a play called Eyes. Mm -hmm. From their eyes, I watching God, which was a, a play uh, of something that took place back during when they had those all black towns in like the 1920s stuff like the 30s and it was a little girl who got caught by her grandma kissing a little boy so the little girl had to be about 12 you know the little boy was around 12 the grandma who was uh in in care of the little girl because something happened to her mom and dad um wind up was like yep See, I was holding off, but I see you, you're smelling yourself, so uh, I'm going to have to go ahead and marry you off because I, you, you can't get with this little dude, you know what I'm saying, 12 years old, he ain't take care of you, he ain't got nothing, you know what I'm saying, so I'm going to have to marry you off to uh, the, uh, the, the name of the dude was Logan Killix, and Logan, he was, she was like, yep, he got the onlyest organ in town, <laughs> he, he can take care of you. And she was like, Logan Kellex, because he was up like a, a dude probably in his 30s, 40s. You know what I'm saying? And she was like, I'm going to have to marry you off to him. You know what I'm saying? I see you smelling yourself. You're getting hot. So here it is. You can't not, uh, uh, you got to be a virgin when I get, m marry you off. Right. So I can't let you get popped by, Pop this, by, by, this, little, by this little boy because he, can't, he can't take care of himself. How are you going to take care of you? you. And, and so she married him off uh, 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 to, to Logan Kellex, who she was about 12 at the time and he was in his like probably 30s or, or 40s this thing was a, a natural thing you know what i'm saying hey, I, that, yeah and i guarantee so? you they wasn't gonna die i feel like i was gonna say real quick i guarantee you by the time that girl who got married off of 12 she didn't fuck 500 dudes by the time she was 35. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. right hey like, look, this is insane this is insane look i was i was in my video feed a video popped up I had sex with 20 men in one night. Right. And I, I never that. got a chance to see the video. Cuz I, I I screenshot it the I screenshot the uh the, the screenshot. Right, Cuz it matter of fact pull it up. It's in, it's in the one of the if you can and put it in there. So I I was like, "Damn, well, I want to see this video." So I put so I put that that title um in the in the YouTube searching and to see if the the video the, the no, image of the sure. girl would pop up but something else popped up and with this chick from california she she all she looked like she was asian or she could have been northern kingdom i really couldn't tell but this bitch talked about how she was having gang bangs on a regular basis right. since she was 19 right. and how she banged 500 in one night i was like what the Found fuck man but she didn't get on there and tell you what to do man tell you about yeah. yourself tell you there's no See, no accountability, man. Nothing's wrong with that, man. And she told the white guy was interviewing her that that she wouldn't she wouldn't date she wouldn't date him. She only she only bangs African American men. That's right. Mm. I'm like, what the hell? And so why was so so oh so only African American men can have a super slap? Is that what you're trying to say? Right. Or your walls just so gone you can't be with somebody else? Exactly. I was Right. What what what's so what what's the scene? What's the screenshot? You know what room? Screenshot. I'm not sure. I check this Let me see if I can. It might have been. It might be an argument. Oh, 
Oh, it's sad, man. Let, let me read this scripture to back up what Jack here has said. This is uh, 1 Corinthians uh, 7 and uh, 9. Oh, uh, yeah. But if they cannot contain, let okay. them marry, for it is better to marry than to burn. So that's what Yaki was saying. Uh, uh, she, she, was, she was smelling herself and this, that, and other. So I got to go on to marry you all. Yep. So, go ahead. This right says, yeah, he saw so wicked. He added this new term, teenager. Yeah. Before it was a child and an adult, man. He yeah. added this term, teenager years, <laughs> and that just screwed up everything, man. Yep. You know, well, well, because a teenager is nothing but a young adult being groomed yeah, yeah. for marriage or for work. The young man is being groomed for his career, so he can so his apprenticeship, so that he can support a family. All right, and the young girl is being saved and groomed. So that she could be placed with a with that young man or an older man. Yep, and then, that was it. Yep. Sometimes even like uh, you, if you were betrothed, if you were already betrothed to to young David, and David was was learning how to be a plumber or learning how to be a goldsmith or whatever it is, you you will you will betrothed to him. Yep. And David and right. So at the time when David came of age, and now he was set up and he was doing his goldsmith stuff. Then you would get married. Yep. And because they would actually have kids sometimes at she was like 13, 14 years old. She had been through the apothecary, you know, maybe for a year, to, you know, or so, you know what I'm saying? And just straight so, up groomed. So you can fucking milk, soaked in oils and, and all kind of. Uh, uh, because uh, we raised the boys and girls, we raised adults. Right. All right. From, from, the from the youth, they were talking about. Okay. Then baby talking child, that's silly as hell. Right. All right. That's not teaching them anything. From their youth, they're learning how to, to grow and be adults, man. Yep. The youngest yep. king of Israel was, was seven, I believe. All right. He was able to, to get counsel. He had leaders and counselors, but he still was the king. There it is, man. And what we're looking at now, this is America. All right. This is Whichever America. song you want to choose, you want to go back to John Mellicamp, Ain't That America. Right. Or you could go to the new school with, with Danny Glover. Hey, all right, hey, right. So like this this is America. That that uh, you know? Benji had made with the um with the king, the youngest king in Israel. And to my knowledge, in that story, what made him the youngest king was a woman had killed all his brothers, and then she tried to set herself up. What happened to that woman? The priest took her outside the temple and beat that bitch to death. That's right. Yeah, jump out, um, right. Josiah. Bitch. Oh, that's well, thank you. Let's say her homework. I gave him a breakdown. Look at that, nigga. Find the story. Look at what you're looking at on the screen. That is, him. and you know what? And this dudes that'll be all in her DMs trying to get with her again, right? Because you know, I, I, you know, she got so much makeup. You know, I don't, I don't know if she really. But from the picture that we're looking at, the woman is attractive. Like All right, that, that a, she's a trap. That's Brittany Rosari. Yeah. Oh, she's married. She's and, and he, and he, yeah, Brittany yeah, Rosari. Yeah, and it's a simple. So, wait, 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 stop, stop. And y'all, he been on that. He did his work. So, she banging 20 guys and he's recording. She's just a picture. That's another man's video, but she's just a picture. But so she has her own OnlyFans. But you know, like, yeah, yeah, she do porn and everything. Yeah. She, she married mm -hmm. to a fucking uh, sad nigga. She uh, thinks she a Jake, but she uh, a Jake mixed with an Ishmaelite. Yeah, oh, Ishmaelite yeah. right, mixed with an Ishmaelite. Like, some bullshit. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that bitch do porn and her man is cut, man. He a cut. He be the. It was a joke, man. Well, okay. with that, but that's America for you. But that's, he's so like that because he really not into the women anyway. He's into the men. Why would you want to see another man ride your woman? Because you're looking at that man. No, you're right. getting off on it's that good. man. It's that good. man's getting off on that man. Damn, I never even thought about it like that. That's what it, it is. Because you will never want to know. Because a real man don't want to even. Man. You don't want to think about a, a man that your woman been with in the past. Hell no. A real man. He got problems with that. He got to block that shit out sometimes. All right? Hey, hey. You know what? That is funny that you said that. Who is that the job? I was at the job and when I was down well, there, I was, I was, I was, I was out of equipment. And I said that to a female. She was talking, they were talking about something about cheating and all this other kind of shit. I said, I'm going to give you the 100% truth. The problem that a man don't want you, first of all, you ain't supposed to be trying to cheat. But the, the thing in his mind is, was this nigga bigger and blah, 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 blah. She went back and asked her husband that. And he said, whoever told you that gave you the 100% truth. That is, a motherfucker don't want to be thinking about you. You'd have been with a nigga that's bigger than him. Period. Well, you met with another man. Period. Right. Right. Because right. 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 he could have been smaller. You enjoyed this motherfucker. Right. You. No. It's not even about that. It's about the fact that 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 
you thinking, well, th this month, do, do, do you miss him? You thinking about him? Right. When I'm popping you, is that what you thinking about? This, it's really can fuck with your head, man. Too much bleed, even, I mean. All it's right, just, so it's, that's it's, why it's, it's, when a man get with a woman, she's supposed to have never been with another man. And, and if a woman, you. and if she, and, and you like that woman who yeah. did that video, if you're this size with the ruler, you can't say shit to me. You know, if you this size, uh, your sandwich will be made, your bread, you know, all this other bullshit. Yeah, so man. So but the point shit. being, has she not been with so many dicks, she wouldn't know the difference between it. That's right. Hey, uh, uh, she wouldn't know. She would She would appreciate and enjoy the man she's with. Yeah. It's a all right? Uh, another dude did a video like with that same clip, but he said, he said, okay, okay. And he pulled out a big ass jar and shit. And he put his, he said, if this is you, he said, he put his oh, fist yeah. in the, he put his fist in the jar. He said, you better shut the fuck up. <laughs> right? You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, God damn, you talking about you big ass fucking gaping wound and shit, man. But we're going to put their whole fall in your ass, man. Like, Tyson, like the bro. brother said, a damn throwing a hot dog down the hallway. Man, man bro. <laughs> no balls. You know, the first time I heard that was a little Asian chick. And, and, that, died. and that goes to show you that, that see you women, man, She's you know, like, uh, this, this, this feminism and this, and this hypergamy got you women thinking you equal to men. You're not no way equal to men, definitely not physically. Because you the one who bleed the first time you get right. fucked, shorty. All right, and then we, and, and then ever and it's all downhill from there. That pussy just gets stressed out. I dick don't get stressed out. I should stay the same my whole life. You tell that to these motherfuckers, they get mad, man. Mm -hmm. I had a whole bunch of people on the fucking um on the goddamn Facebook fucking trying to argue with me and shit, man. And so we can make our vagina any size we want. What bitch surgery, bitch? No, don't worry, don't know where they gonna find. They gonna find out. These women think they're equal to men. They're going to find out the hard way. The hard way. The hard way. Yeah, brother. We got to put them in a first Timothy 5. Yeah. But she that liveth in pleasure is dead while she lives fast. Yeah, you are. That's what the women are all about is pleasure. Oh, I want to go have fun. Oh, I want to go experience this. I want to go to this. Well, the Lord, the Lord's going to come back and fuck this place up. I might as well have some fun before he do. I have fun with the place that he about to destroy. Okay, so go ahead on and touch the shit that the same thing the most I about to destroy. All right. You know, they want to go play, they want to go to the woods and fucking forest fire, man. That's right. right. You know, what? We, got, we got a build in America. Motherfucker, the forest on fire. Right. We That's got it. out this plot of land. We're going to knock right. down these trees and put up a fence. Nigga, nigga hey, the, the forest is in. on fire, nigga. Fire Have in. you looked at the trees lately? They <laughs> fucking dying all across America, man. Mm -hmm. hey, That's where you you know, I don't want to say too much, but. Your respiratory issues. Yeah. All right. Actually, and people and animals. Look at the fucking trees. The, the uh uh the amount of trees that got death. You know, no, no, no leaves on them, man. Well, that's because they've been thinned out so much. They thinned out they, like they, a they, motherfucker. And so they can't they cannot um the way we breathe, we breathe in oxygen and ex, ex, exhale CO2. Well the cheese trees breathe in and CO2 and breathe out oxygen. If you cut off a whole bunch of their their um, breathing apparatus, well, even the ones that ain't been touched to them, they they you know yeah. it's the shit they spray. It. And that too, yeah, yeah. that's, that's what it comes down to. Mm -hmm. All that, that, that lime yeah. green, yellow green shit in, in <laughs> fucking July. <coughs> uh, leaves supposed to be a deep emerald green, man. Until they already fading up fall fucking colors, man. I ain't made it to August yet. Yeah. Right, September they start because September is so late. Late fall. September is when right. they start. Right. Yeah, a lot of trees been destroyed. My brother, he got a book. Uh, Chicago in the 60s. And they got pictures of how different neighborhoods used to look throughout Chicago. And I know it's like spots where trees used to be at. You go back to that neighborhood now, the tree ain't there no more. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. I got a oh. precept. This is Job 12 and 7. But ask now the beasts, and they shall teach thee, and the fowls of the air, and they shall tell thee. So the animals got more sense than you motherfuckers. They, they, they see a fire coming, they running the other way, man. All right, man. And, and and they're letting you know these animals are an indicator, you know, just like you know the elder always said the women are an indicator of a, of the state of a nation. The animals are an indicator and of the state of the is earth. This the state of fucking America, the whole world for that matter, because America has an influence over the the, the vibration of America yeah. is over Leave the whole the world, world, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, uh, right. It says upon whom has that iniquity not passed through, man? We, we all saw the big booty uh bitch in Iran. Working on the light bulb, yep. man. Everybody saw that, man. She had a great big old ghetto booty too. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know they had booties like that in Iran. All right, and she was working that thing too. But the point being is that where did she get that from? Mm -hmm. The nigga. All right, she got that from watching Keisha. That's right. 
Right? Uh, Watch it fucking uh, 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 Beyonce. The, the scripture does say the, the our sins have passed the, the you know the deeds of basically the heathens. We we take everything to a whole nother level. So back in when Esau was sitting there showing it showed you their nipples with the with the nipple little thing that they put over their nipple the pastry, pastry whatever pasty whatever they call it. Then niggas nigga woman starts saying, well let me give me the stripper pole. You know what I'm saying? But then they start doing this niggas well nigga woman said well let me twerk. You know what I'm saying? They take it wickedness to a whole nother right, level. Jake, take it to it. It's just like. When Jake be be a homosexual, they be a super homosexual. Mm -hmm. Blame it. Right. You know, Esau be, you know, reserved homosexual. Man, when Jake be a homosexual, man, he RuPaul. Right, know? right, no, he, right, right, he, right. He, like they you, do, that do work. Hey, you know? In Atlanta, yeah. they had these uh, <laughs> you know? these groups where they would go dance and shit, and they would just those fabulous they would have like uh, uh coochie cutters on, uh right. just tight shit, and then just doing all the, you know what I'm saying, and thinking the, the dances and shit. Oh my God! Uh, and it's sickening, man. Sickening, man. I got, I got. And you know who who would cheer and clap for them? The, the nigga woman. The nigga, nigga woman. Keisha. And matter of fact, these nigga women, they be they be befriending these gay niggas, uh, yeah. being their best friends, and fucking these niggas, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey. They they these 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 metrosexual, uh, homosexual niggas, they'll still they 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 divided. They still want to get the the, the ride dip too. Hey, 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 but that little gay nigga, he said that in his uh, new song. He said that uh, he, he he's queer. But he said all these bad bees on my dick. So yeah, the, the nigga woman loves the homo. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and know what they'll do? They'll, they'll call a man like Kevin Samuels gay, right? They'll call Kevin Samuels gay, but I thought gay people was cool, right? This is Jeremiah two and twenty three. Oh, uh, this is Jeremiah two and thirty three. Why trimmest thou way? Why trimmest thou thy ways to seek love? Therefore, hast thou also taught the wicked ones thy ways? So hey, man, hey, look. Hey, it is what it is, man. Jacob, Jacob is a form of all things, even wickedness, man. All right. Hey, th this banking system came from Jake. All right. Uh, those those damn uh the Spanish Inquisition, them torture methods, and all those fucking the, the damn donkey and all that shit they had. Jake made all that shit, man. So hey, yeah, look. all that dark age tor torture shit. You know, yeah, you're right, man. Because Jake was ruling that time. Mm -hmm. Jake talked, Jake, Jake and, and, and now what? it's just Mm -hmm. On a whole different level of demented, but yeah, Jake started that shit. Man. Yeah. So hey, so here it is. You know, yeah, uh, Esau created the porn industry. Yeah, he created the strip club. <laughs> but shit, Jake took that shit to a whole other goddamn level, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Jake, Jake, Jake showed it. Show you how it's really done. Hey, I remember uh, a couple years back, me and the brother, we was watching. Um, me and the brother Madafi, we was watching um, Beverly Hills Cop. And it showed you the strippers, and uh, the strippers was whack, mad whack, man. You know what I mean? You look at these motherfuckers nowadays, they motherfucking, these motherfuckers could win the Olympics. <laughs> like, goddamn, this shit is literally athletic, man. These motherfuckers doing some shit that they can't even do in the Olympics, man. Why, man? Hey, the, the, Jacob, Jake was just wicked as fuck, man. And you've taught the wicked ones your ways, man. Okay? But there's a recompense for that, man. What the scripture says, it says, uh, Oh, uh, oh! Uh, walk in the ways of thy heart, but know for all these things. Um, yeah. So, hey, look, man, have your hot girl summer, man. Do what you're gonna do. You know what I mean? Guess what? No accountability. You know what that leads up to you? The Lord just judging your ass for all the shit that you got away with, thought you got away with, man. That's why the scripture says, when we are chastened under the Lord, uh, it is that so we uh, uh not be condemned with the world, man. All right, that's why I should just tell us. See, we're we, we're being held accountable, man. And it's a beautiful thing to be held accountable, man. That's right. You know, uh scripture says uh one may seem uh um uh, a first in his own cause, but his neighbor come and searches them, man. Okay, so here it is. We checking ourselves, we getting ourselves in order, man. And what are you doing? Fucking playing, man. You know, that's why that Micah 7 and uh uh 9 on down. Yo, you, you, you nigga women gonna be trodden down like the mire the street. All them baby daddies, all them en enemies you made. When, when that 911 gets shut off, y'all talking about defund the police and all that shit, man. The only reason why you bitches got any fucking power is because of the police. Because you can pick up 911. And you got these simps and poopies and ray rays and cousins that want to get in your fucking business, man. But that's what? They ain't gonna they ain't show you in that movie World War Z. That cop didn't have no time to worry about nobody. That motherfucker cop ran up in that goddamn um. He ran up in that motherfucking grocery store. He said, "I'm worried about my own fucking house." Uh, they, they, they showed you that uh, they just showed it in uh, Detroit. 
uh, some the police was right oh, there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Some niggas pulled up with, with the stick. They look like an AR or something. <laughs> bah, bah, bah. The police fucking drove off, man. Hey, like, they hey, just hey. showed it in uh, South Africa. Go. Hey, hey, in, in South Africa, <laughs> yeah, you know, it's been, they've been all out purged in South Africa. Yep. Yep. And and they showed the, uh, the cops were using the police cars to take uh, uh, stuff from the stores down. themselves. Hey. The cops were doing it. And this is recent, man. Right. Hey. Meanwhile, right. Elm and, 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 and oh, Esau yeah, yeah. is off. shooting down Ham and Jake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right? So they outright going back and forth with each other, killing each other. Yeah. Meanwhile, the police ain't trying to get in the middle of that. They were you, they somebody from a hotel room or a high rise building had their cameras on the cops, and the cops were loading up the cop cars and vans mm -hmm. and stolen merchandise, man. Mm -hmm. You know right. what? It's funny you say that. Uh, when, when they did all that looting here in yep. Chicago yep. and whatnot, I was coming from my, my my wife's house back to my apartment, and I was coming down 75th Street, no, 79th Street. But I got right up there at the, at the uh, if y'all know about it, 79th up there on Exchange, right there, there's a fucking liquor store and whatnot, right there on the railroad track. I flipped the window, flipped that corner, that motherfucker was in that liquor store, and there was, there was two cops. Sitting inside a squad, a, a squad van type shit, looking at that shit. And when somebody asked, "Are y'all gonna do anything?" Motherfuckers looked at each other and drove off. I was dying. They were like, "Man, fuck this shit." Because they, because these motherfuckers, they value their life. You know what I'm saying, and they know that when it, when yeah, they, I don't matter know. Matter of fact, I read it earlier, but uh, um, an unruly multitude. He said that's worse than death yeah. because yeah. you never what what's gonna happen. The, the, main, the madness and the chaos, you getting jacked up and fucked up. Now, a wise person, but you like, say, are you going to go mess with them? Uh, no. <laughs> We're going the other, the right. other way. He's man. like, I got a Glock <laughs> with, with, with 19 shots in it, <laughs> and that's 300 <laughs> niggas. Right, right, right. 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 I'll get a couple. I, 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 I said that pretty 19 now when I have. My asshole, my asshole. <laughs> and after you bust the taste a couple times, you gotta go get the shit out for charges, do whatever the fuck that's dead. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Wow. And then all you got is a billy club. You know? What I'm you know? <laughs> and these niggas, all the niggas, half yeah. the niggas got guns and shit. Shit, the cops up here was stacking their trunk and yep. shoes, man. I don't believe, believe it. Lot. Fuck that. Mm -hmm. I don't believe it. Yeah. But should we always see, don't go there, because we, we actually know uh, cops personally who used to back in the day, you remember? Would, um, they'll go get some money. I mean, get some money or weed off a of nigga, and then they'll come and say, "Hey, I got the whole bunch of weed. You want this?" Oh, no, they used to, niggas are notorious. Cops are notorious <laughs> for robbing niggas over here in Chicago. Hey, That's why they don't have to no do respect. It, they used to do it in the Beirut all the time. Yeah. Right? yeah. All right. I've actually, I've actually seen them do it over in Beirut, man. Mm -hmm. Roll up on on on, on a drug dealer and tax him. That's it. All right. That's and, it. The, and the drug, basically, the drug Training dealer, day. The, the <laughs> drug dealer paid them. To, to stay in business, protection. Yeah, it's like you either going to jail or you not. What you got? <laughs> That's it. Hey. Now, and so, the, so the drug dealer would, you know, would give him a uh, five hundred bucks, thousand bucks, two thousand, how much money? Boom, and he would lead a dude to to. And, so, and a lot of these, and look, they don't want to hear it, but a lot of these uh, uh, cops are still gang affiliated. Yeah, it's like you got these 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 uh these Edomite cops that are white white superior already organization affiliated. Right, and they support those things, man. You got. You got Jason's gang affiliated that 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 will actually help defend their gang territory against the other gangs. Well, they'll only arrest the oppositions. Yeah. All right, shit like that, man. Or well, they'll roll down on the opposition and shake them down and let their own guys keep dip dealing, man. This shit, this shit, sort of shit still goes on, this man. Shit, My it. fucking neighbor across the street, uh, uh, her brother, I believe her brother got out this year, and then he did ten years. Uh, uh, and, and he did 10 years to save because he they both were cops, man. Brother Aisha know her. Mm -hmm. He grew up with the bitch. He mm -hmm. know her. Yeah, and, and, and uh, matter of fact, he knew when she was cheating on her first husband. Thank you. But she, yeah, but she's a fucking dirty cop. So was her brother. And a whole bunch of cops got caught doing some dirt shit. And her mm -hmm. brother took the fall for her, so she wouldn't have to go to jail, too. Mm -hmm. He yeah. figures, like, fuck it. There ain't no need for both of oh, us to go out. I'm, I'm the older. I'm your brother. I'll do I got you. Yeah. So her brother went to jail for her ass, man. She stood on his night. Hey, uh, this is uh, Luke 314. This buggy, please. <laughs> this is, uh, and the soldiers likewise demanded of him, saying, And what shall we do? Come to Yahushai asking, What shall we do to make it to the kingdom? And, and Yahushai said unto them, Do violence to no man, neither accuse any falsely, and be content with your wages. And that's the three things cops dare rarely ever do. They, they lie on niggas all the time, uh, and they're not content with their wages. They steal from oh, people. They and, they got, yep, and they plant shit on you. Yeah. Yeah, I just saw some accused falsely. Yeah, Instagram. They had this uh, JP was like filming 
you know, you know, secretly. The cop was, you know, doing whatever. He just threw a, a coke bag, you know, in the yeah. back seat. And he's like, hey, "What are you doing?" You know, he's like, "You know, I just, I'm filming you." He's like, "Yeah, we're filming you too." You know, right? And the cop tried to, you know, play it off like it wasn't shit, man. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then they got right, and then they got the blue wall of science. Go to show you. There's no such thing as a, a, a silence. There's no such thing as a good cop. No. Because if you're a cop and you know that these cops are doing all sort of thing and they're yes, railroaded and taking your people to fucking jail. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Hey, uh, Hurricane Katrina. Yeah. You nigga women was going to the police to, uh, to get help. They gang raped your ass, man. And that's what's been, a, man, you nigga women, you motherfuckers finna get it, man. You finna get it. The, uh, uh, Hurricane Katrina. Them motherfucking nigga women was getting gang raped by the cops, man. And the, the same at the FEMA camp. By your daddy, your daddy, as you call anytime you get into it with, 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 with a nigga. All right? Hey, a day gonna come, man, when they gonna come, man. And then they gonna come. <laughs> all right? They all gonna come. You know what I'm saying? You know, they all fall down. You know? Yeah, the cops gonna come, all right? Yeah. You know? Multiple. Hey, that one that what that one that what the dude two dudes told <laughs> Natalie Portman and uh and and, and beef of endeavor. Mm -hmm. They told her uh that, you know that's a that's a hard pill to swallow, but you gonna swallow. <laughs> yeah. and so they were telling her she basically they she was gonna swallow both of them. Yeah. Damn. Because they caught her ass out after the curfew. Mm -hmm. Shit. Get them drunk. Right. Yeah, hey, that's why I should have said many days. It ain't gonna be no dude with a mask to show up and and martial arts your ass and save you either. Exactly. <laughs> hey, right. because it's gonna be happy. Yeah. Because all these boogies and ray rays and sex, huh. man, they go they, these emotional niggas, man, that you spawned, right? It's gonna say mistress, women show uh bring forth bring monsters. forth monsters. Them niggas gonna be the first one to die because they're not strategic, they emotional, they're gonna run out with their Draco and fucking get their ass laid out. Oh my auntie can't eat, y'all done shut down all these. Oh, oh, this man, right? Y'all hey. niggas emotional. You go run outside and get your ass whacked, man. You know what? You know, it's funny, it's funny you say that. It's funny you say that. I went to pick up Kanaf after he had uh, uh, injured his leg and whatnot. And while I'm sitting there waiting for, for him to come out, this this wildebeest bitch comes over to the truck. And, and I'm like, look, I, 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 I don't need to, I don't want to talk. I don't, I don't, I don't need to do that. Nothing, nothing. Just leave me fucking alone. Don't say nothing to me. Okay, so now some little short motherfucker come up with a baseball cap. Hey man, what is that? What, what, what happened to that bar, man? You know, I said, man, don't come over here ask me about no bitch. Blah 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 blah. Please, step. I told her to step off. You step the fuck off, man. Why you want to call her a bitch? <laughs> wow. Man. I got a priest up, <laughs> and this guy said thirteen, yeah, and um. <laughs> I'm just, I'm starting 13. I'm starting 12. I'm gonna start at 11. And I will punish the world for their evil and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease. I will lay low the harshness of the terrible. Our right, Lord is about to bring his people yeah. low, man. All right, you gotta understand that you, they went to trust me how I should be how I was shot. All right. I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man than the golden wedge over here. You gotta understand that the men of the Lord. That gold that the Lord has chosen, man, and left them more precious than it. All right. And therefore, real fine. Mm -hmm. therefore, I will shake the heavens and the earth shall move out of her place, and the wrath of your high host and the day of this fierce anger. And it shall be as the chaste road, and as the sheep that no man taketh up. They shall every man turn to his own people and flee everyone to his own land. Everyone that is found shall be thrust through, and everyone that is joined up to them shall fall by the sword. So everybody holding on to this place is it's, it's toast, man. 100 percent is no is no escaping it. So here's the point. Their children also shall be dashed to pieces before their eyes, their houses shall be spoiled, and their wives ravished. So everything the brothers are saying, you know, it may sound harsh, but it's judgment. Judgment is fucking harsh. There's gonna be a lot of rape bitches out there ravished. It, it, but you know what? The it's not harsh judgment. You know why? Because every time you have a woman who comes against that man, breaks that man's heart, breaks up the family home, and fucks the door, that hurts more than all that shit. You gotta pay for that shit. We, the, the, we, 
one seed of wickedness sprouts into multiple seeds of wickedness because now you're teaching as the mother, so is the daughter. Now you're teaching your daughter this dumbass shit. You're teaching these young men not to value the woman. If you can't value the man, you teach these young men not to value the woman. It works the same, motherfucker. Now you, the, the wickedness begets wickedness, which begets wickedness. So all that shit, you think this is harsh? No, this shit is righteous, and I hope it's harsh, and I hope you fucking burn in hell. Right. Uh, <laughs> uh, you yes, will. he deserved it. I hope he burned in hell. Right, so so at the end of the day, man, as scripture says, judgment, uh, 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 mercy rejoices. Uh, uh, he shall have mercy. He have judgment without mercy to him that have shown no mercy. Any motherfucker who will go murder their own child in the womb, man, you're un you're an unmerciful motherfucker. I'm not ready man. for a child, but I'm ready for sex. You know? Right. So and, and why? Because because that's gonna mess up your Friday Saturday night party. Party. I won't be able to go out, hang out with my bitches, and be a hoe. Then you turn around, you get pregnant a couple more times, and do the same thing. So not only did you kill one child, you killed the you killed the whole fucking family. You killed brother, sister, twins, siblings, mm -hmm. and that wound. Yeah, All right. That's true. And yeah. that wound. That's a merciless motherfucker, man. There's been women, there's been women that have been had so many abortions they can't even carry a kid full term now. Let's see. What, what's, what's that scripture that says? Uh. Uh, uh, you show no mercy to your brother. Yep, and, and, I know a woman who had a child simply for that reason, because she couldn't get another abortion. God damn. So she didn't even want a child. She just had to have a child. You you say, 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 if you do that, you might not be able to walk the bound. You know? You'll fuck mm -hmm. yourself up. You know? But that, uh, what it says, uh, does, does thou ask mercy? You know? You don't show no mercy, but do us thou ask for mercy? Because mm -hmm. a lot of you bitches, see, they got a saying that says, you got more excuses than a nigga going to jail, man. You bitches finna have nothing but excuses in these last days. It's always a but. Yeah. You it's know? All, like I said, it's always a but. But put, put the image of that. Don't before you forget. Yeah. Put that that picture back up. It's can always he, a but. Can he can he bring this? Absolutely. Well, it, it says uh, before you forgive her for cheating. Remember that the other nigga had her like this. Oh, yeah. And then the other saying at the bottom was that uh he put it, 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 it out. It, no, it, 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 it came out, but she put it back in. Right. Remember, yeah, remember yep. it slipped out, she put it back right. in. Right, it yep. slipped out, but she put it back yep. in. Yep. Mm -hmm. He said, wow, man. That's why that proverb say, uh, I'm going to just get it. Uh, you guys saw what I'm going to yeah. uh, This is Sirach 28 and 4. He showeth no mercy to a man which is like himself. And do as he ask forgiveness of his own sins? Right. So, hey, man, ain't going to be no mercy for y'all, man. Ain't nobody going to feel sorry for you, man. This week says, who shall go outside and ask how thou doest, man? Right. Ain't nobody, listen, when all hell breaks loose here in America, ain't nobody going to be worried about your ass, man. I, I got to wait. wait. It's Proverbs 634. For jealousy is the rage of a man. Therefore, he will not spare his vengeance. He will not regard any ransom. Neither will he rest, con rest content. Now they give you, uh, those out give as many gifts. Right, man, men are fed up with you bitches, man. You bitches have offended things, man. Hey, was that you who right. that put that uh, world star up where that dude walked in, uh, the dude yes. hit his wife from the back and stabbed and both of them joints yes. up, you know what I'm And killed her in mercy. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. I remember that. That was yeah. cold blooded. Yeah. I saw that, that was oh, yeah. sounds like, like a righteous judgment. Right. 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 Hey, somebody get that Debbie Sore Strokes and, and bring out whatever you had a couple brothers on. Wisdom of Solomon, chapter. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 19, verse 1. As for the ungodly, wrath came upon them without mercy. Unto wow. Them. They Sin. knew before what they would do. You know? And that, that's righteous judgment for them, man. All right? You read what you sow. <laughs> no mercy. That's what happens when you just live no a life mercy. of unaccountability, man. When you let all your, the scripture says, be not, uh, don't add sin to sin. Right, yeah. It says, be not, uh, 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 without fear. Without fear to add sin to sin, man. Because this day is gonna come when it all just drops on you, man. You want to get punished little by little, man. You want you want to you want to get you know the Lord the Lord's chastising us. Like I said, uh, like the scripture says, uh, that we be not condemned with the world, man. Right. You know okay, I have one more. Uh, this rock twenty five and nineteen. All wickedness is but little to the wickedness of a woman. Hey, that's right, brother. The scripture marvel not if she uh, trespass. trespass against you, because you know what she is. Even if it's in disobedience, if it's in talking back, or even further off, I'm being a hoe and harlot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this or she'll just go and disobey your orders. She'll do something that you just told her not to do. Yeah. All right. I remember that happened after uh, my, my, uh, my, my, my son's mother 
uh, I, I forget what it was. I told her something not to do, and she went. She went and took the car, and went and she went to go do. I think she may have gone to the gym, and um, it was something else that needed to be done. I was like, you could just do that tomorrow, and, and she went anyway, and she ended up getting to a car wreck. Damn, they destroyed, they totaled the car, and damn, they died. Yeah. But but I had already told her not to go. <laughs> yeah, probably got yeah. instruction. She'd have missed all that. Shit. No, you know? I, I got a saying: if you if you tell Keisha something to do, man, if you really want to do something, you got to tell the officer. You got yeah. to. Yeah. yeah. And then, then I tell you what she didn't do, and I gave her the money. Here's the fucked up part: I had gave her the money to pay the insurance, and she didn't pay it. So the car, so the car got totaled, and, and then no we we then we weren't covered because she didn't. So we ended up being stuck with the bill for that fucking car. That's fucked up. Yeah. So she fucked you. So so one little fucking act double. of disobedience, man. Double, got double on this time. Let the portion of the sinner fall upon her. That the portion of and what's the wages of sin? Yeah. yeah, yeah. You motherfucking nigga women, you're gonna be the most deadest motherfucker in America. Well, wait, wait, we just went over earlier how that they're the majority, like as far as the ratio. So obviously if they're the majority, and then the brother that posted up earlier, uh, and, and, then, and that goes for you, damn you, you, you Edomite women, you fucking heathen women, all right? Oh, you bitches yeah. are just as rebellious, man. That's it. That's yeah, you it. Woman, you, all right. You did the most, the most fucked up thing, J two, man. Yeah, well they they yeah. actually helped institute all this shit, mm-hmm. right? right? But all these damn women, man. You know, I was downtown uh, earlier today, man, mm-hmm. and, and and like I said, these heathens all came to America. So that they could be harlot because they couldn't do that shit in the country where they came from. That's know? right. And you can't even be no nigga. Get a. You can't even go to another country, be a nigga, and get a bunch of women pregnant and just be a pookie, man. They'll kill your fucking ass, man. All right. You go. Then you go. Yes, you go to China and get a hundred bitches pregnant, and you just a I'll nigga on the couch, man. They'll fucking cry to kick your ass into the spirit world, man. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah. The Chinese are known for very insidious. Uh, torture and punishment, all kinds of shit. You know, the <laughs> fucking bamboo and the fingernails, all kind of weird shit. The, the drip, the water, the, the, the drip. Yeah, the yeah. Water, water, drip. Chinese water, 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 water torture. Yeah, yeah. You, you can't go. You can't be a. See, that's, see, this, see uh, that's how you know Esau is that eagle, man. What is the eagle, man? It's the most filthy fucking bird in the sky, man. And what is it? But it's like the highest. It's line. cruel and it's and it's proud. Yeah. yeah. So so this is what is it? Exalted filth, man. That's what America is, man. Exalted filth, man. Scripture says, uh, uh, folly is set in great dignity, man. Okay. Uh, exalt. They exalt the most ungodly, wicked, fucking filth in the fucking world. Okay. Oh, uh, like that. Uh, that fucking fag on a damn uh, bus with me the other day, all yeah. loud and ignorant, talking about his sexual ex- exploits. Oh loud, and oh even my. even had the even had the nigger woman on there. Jesus, you know, <laughs> <laughs> right? Nobody wanted to hear that bullshit, man. But you know what? It's you women who allowed yeah. that. It's you. You don't understand, Crazy man. Like no, and not only that, because they 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 say promote. they promote it, say that it's okay. So now this this old loud ass and it would it wouldn't happen. It was now. one it was one obnoxious nigga after the next obnoxious nigga after the next man. Yeah. That day that day was torture, man. I was on my way to the Everstate camp, man. Mm. I got I get on the bus yeah, wow. and there's a fucking it's a fucking little two third ass nigga. That and that's what started this whole thing. I was talking about that on the video. Mm. No one defended him though. A little two third ass nigga got a bracelet on his ankle. Ain't supposed to be leaving home. He don't even. He not even at home. He at his sister's house. His sister looking out for him because obviously his parents and gave up on him. And he on the phone arguing with his sister about fuck that. I go sit down and walk the band. And his sister's pleading with him just go back home. It's just almost over with. You only got a month and they go take it off. And you know and I got you a job. I got you a job lined up. Come and he just being a nigga, just being a nigga, man. I'm like, I don't want to kill this little nigga myself, man. So I leave him. Get on the next bus. You got a drunk ass nigga get on the bus with his woman, pretty ass wife, and 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 they, I guess they're going downtown because everybody knew their business by the time it was over because oh. it was so loud. Damn. Damn. She he he supposed he she sits down. She's he's riding down with her so they can go pick up a check, but she ain't got no money on her, so she goes sit down expecting him to pay, and he had the money to pay, didn't want to pay. He just didn't simply he just wanted to get on the bus and not pay. It caused all this fucking drama on the bus. No, you can't make this shit up. He caused all, got everybody on the bus getting mad. Man, we got places to be. You know, niggas getting riled up. And, you know, he 
Shut the shit. fuck up, man. He drunk as shit, talking shit, and this woman crying and she embarrassed. So she get up there and try to rip through her purse for change. Finally, another nigga want to get one to get up. It's like, I, I got you, sister. I got you, baby. I'll do it. And then she like, no. She tells a woman, no. The woman trying to pay a fare. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? So it's, it's crazy. So, so we go one block. Hold on. We go one block. And another bitch get on drunk as fuck, and and she ain't got no money at all, and and the dude come up and pay her fare, <laughs> and so his wife looking at him like, are you fucking serious? And it, it, it was embarrassing as fuck, man, because he here he come his drunk ass up there. I got you, girl, and he paid her fare, but he just caused all this fucking. I wanted to beat this nigga ass, man. <laughs> man, I wanted to beat this nigga ass. Then, right before, <laughs> we're talking about the 14, so right before you make the long stretch down, wow. last stop, fucking loud mouth fucking fag gets on the, on the bus, and he loud as fuck, and he arguing with his sister, speakerphone, so you can hear all this shit, and he loud as fuck, oh, and I'm and even through my headphones, man, I'm trying to listen to the, to the elders, trying to drown all this shit out, and this nigga get on the bus, and he arguing with his sister, and his sister talking about what well, shit. I ain't had no dick. He like, bitch, I ain't had no dick either. Oh, oh, man. Man. I ain't been fucked since April 18th. I'm like, oh my. Nobody want to hear it, man. Because his hip was fucked up. And she, and, and she, and so, oh man. And he, and he talking about, hey, you can't make, hey, look, man, we got to get the fuck out of here, man. We got to get the fuck out of here. Because he talking about my hip hurt, not my ass. And when my ass was hurt, it was a good hurt. Because that what? nigga big like me. I'm telling oh you, you can't God. make it. If I were to record oh this God. shit, man, I was so fucking livid, man. That was yes. the day I, I came up to yes. met, met y'all. I don't think you were you, were you there this, this Friday at camp. Pops, were you there this Friday? You were nah. nah, You were not there. Yeah, you were not there. But the, all that yeah. shit that happened that's on my way coming to camp, that's what I had to endure, man. And I, and I was on my way to go do the work, man. So, you know what, man? This place just got to fucking go, man. It got to fucking go. Who, who got that last scripture? Hey, last scriptures, man. We're going to shut this shit down. I got the last one. We're going to shut it down. Go ahead, brother. This second Peter 2, I'm going to start uh, F6. And turn the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah to ashes, condemn them with an overthrow, making them an example unto those that after should live ungodly. So this place has to be destroyed by uh, thermal nuclear destruction. Okay. And deliver just lot. That's with the filthy conversation of the wicked. For mm-hmm. well, that righteous man dwelling among them and seeing and hearing, that's his righteous soul from day to day with their unlawful deeds. The Lord, and this is an important point, verse 9, the Lord knoweth how to deliver the godly out of temptations and to reserve the unjust of the day of judgment to be punished. So that whole, you know, all the wicked niggas, as vexed as it was, and that's their lot to be destroyed. So the Lord gave them to their minds. He, he wanted he want his ass to hurt. All right, but that's just, that's the Lord locked him into that space so he can get his destruction. Yeah, the Lord gonna give him a missile right up his ass. <laughs> she ain't gonna like that ass. <laughs> hey, 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 Till next time. Wow, shit. Yeah. It meant, brother, that was a hell of a fucking bus ride.